on the field. It's seven o'clock, so we'll get the meeting started. Uh, we'll start with the Pledge of Allegiance. <laughs> Pledge of Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Roll call. Mr. Hall, <coughs> here. Mr. Hogue. Anyone heard anything from Mr. Hogue tonight? Um, Mr. Merlington? Here. Ms. Naparowski? Here. Uh, Mr. Nixon? Doesn't appear to be here. And uh, Mr. Conley is here. We've got uh, Mr. Womack, the manager, Mr. Moore, our city planner, and Ms. Johnson, our city clerk here this evening. Um, Anyone's had a you've had a chance to look over the minutes from March 8th, 2022. We need to approve those or? I would make a motion to approve the minutes from the regular meeting, March 8th. I'll second. Anything we need to look at on those minutes or are we comfortable moving forward? All right, all in favor of approving the minutes from uh, the regular meeting of March 8th, 2022, please signify with aye. 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 All opposed? Motion carries and it's approved. Uh, tonight's agenda on, of course, on page one of your packet. It's tonight's agenda. Um, need to approve if anyone would like to make that motion. Make a motion to approve the agenda. Anything that we need to adjust on the agenda tonight, or is it good as it stands? It's good. Hearing nothing, we um, all in favor of approving tonight's agenda, please signify with aye. 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 All opposed? Uh, the agenda is approved. Item six, public comments. Those citizens wishing to speak on agenda and non-agenda items will be allowed a maximum of four minutes each to address their concerns. This is the only time during the meeting that citizens are allowed to address the planning commission. Please state your name and address for the record if you would like. So uh, anyone in here, if you'd like to approach the microphone, please, you're welcome to do so. Um, and that same uh, offer extends to anyone who may be on Zoom. I'm not sure if we have anyone on Zoom at the moment or not. So. Not seeing a wild stampede. Oh, go ahead. <laughs> I'm not sure. So uh, my name is Mike Dykstra and I, myself and Josh, oh, here's Josh. Um, I just want to make sure we were on the agenda. So we're for 270 West Street. Yes, I believe so. Yeah, your item 9B. So you're Try to extend our special use. Okay. Yeah, here come. Yeah. That's all I wanted to check. We'll definitely talk to you then then if you, if you want to wait until that point. You have the right as a citizen to speak now if you'd like, or you can wait. No, no, I just wanted to make sure. Um, Absolutely. And so is it a ways off yet? Uh, we have, I, I can't tell you exactly how much time it is, but we do have a rather large site plan in front of yours. Okay. So I, I don't know how long we'll be in that. Okay. All right. Thank you. Our computer messed up. Any other public comments? Hearing none, we'll close the public comments. And we'll move on to item seven, conflicts of interest and ex parte communication inquiry. So do any members of the planning commission have any conflicts of interest or ex parte communication they'd like to divulge? Okay, well, I believe you. Uh, then hearing none, we'll move on to the scheduled public hearings. There are none, which takes us to item nine, site plan reviews. Uh, Site plan review, this is item 9A, site plan review application for White Creek Flats multifamily development at 14300 White Creek Avenue. Uh, this is, um, from what I've seen, this is a large um, and complex uh, set of site plans. So um, not sure the best way to approach this. I mean, it, 
normally in the past, we've had Mr. Womack kind of give us a little description of what's going on. We hear from the city planner. Of course, we're also going to want to hear from the applicants. Um, Mr. Womack, would you want to start or would, would defer to Mr. Moore? It's, it's sure. totally up to you. Uh, I'll introduce him. And uh, of course, Mr. Moore is uh, the planner and he knows this way better than I do. So we'll lean into him next. Um, this is a multifamily development that is proposing, I believe, 164 apartments, uh, property located at 14300 White Creek Avenue, uh, which is north of the hotel and kind of abutting the Brook multifamily. Uh, 